Hey guys, I will be um, taking you loose my braids. So just lay down on me, let your love just fall like rain, just rain on me. Because I, it's clear that I am done with these braids. They were very big, and I think the bigger the braids, the less they last. And they're starting to get all tangled up and stuff. Like, there's one in the back that's just truly given up. Like, okay. We're just gonna do it. Mm, I have on, I have a perm, but I'm probably trying, I'm trying to go back natural, so. And these birds are very long, so. Yeah. Okay, so now I got the glove. Okay, I got the scissors. And now we are going to cut maybe down here. Yeah, cut like down here. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to cut all these brains. We can't really go to the beauty supply store and get hair, so I forget it, man. I already started cutting. All right. Oh. How do I? I remember how I learned that song. I learned that song from like second grade. My first time second grade teacher. Used to do that song, meaning that how much time. So, I'm not really good at explaining. Okay, okay. So basically, if um if we were like told to do something, or uh like trying to flip to a certain page or whatever, she would probably she would be like, all right. So guys, I'm going to sing this song, and when I'm done with the song, you should probably be, you should be done with it. And if you're not, then you're late or whatever. I guess. So, once it gets to the end of the song, you have to be in that place or done with something. Huh? That had me scared. I thought I cut my actual hair. <gasps> this one's shorter. So, and this one's kind of long. Let me cut the same length. Just in case I want to, like... Just in case I want it to be the same length. I like it. Okay, so because of this quarantine, I can't see my friends. I miss my friends. I miss the high school, even though I'm gonna be in high school next year. You know, guys, I would have been in ninth grade this year, but I feel like it would have sucked. Because here's the reason why I think it would have sucked. Because um, my first year in school. I don't want it to be ruined but I'm kind of a senior in middle school so um so I guess my last year in high my last year you know what my my last year in, in middle school was literal hell to me to me I'm just over exaggerating Okay, because the teachers that I had were just, ugh. Like, one of them got fired because... Oh, yeah, one of my teachers got fired because he doesn't know how to keep his hands to himself. He thought the kid was about to attack him, which he wasn't. He was trying, he was just walking past them, basically. Or trying to approach him, I think. That's what the video looks like. I would I would insert it, but maybe not because I'll probably get in trouble. Demonetized? Or something like that? I don't know. But it was serious or whatever. Shouldn't have touched the kid in the first place. Man, you probably wouldn't have gotten fired 
and I think and he was crying bro like he came in the room crying I felt bad when he came in crying because not only that he was my teacher that I started the year off with so in some ways I felt bad and in some ways I didn't the reason why I did the reason the reason why I felt bad is because that's the teacher I started my year off and I and I don't like seeing people cry it makes me sad you know it sucks to see an adult male cry in front of you I'm probably gonna have to what is it called again it's called okay I'm probably gonna need a vacuum I forgot the name Ooh, that's not good see but is that even it no this one like you have truly given up you've given up like I can literally see the hair my hair sticking out it's not even that serious bro I should have put it in a bun one time. I only got to wear it in like three hairstyles. Like I got this done like literally two weeks ago and it looks a mess now because because of this one braid. You You were supposed to lead the team to victory, but you did. But she did it. Okay, I'm gonna cut this one. Alright. Yeah guys. I'm crazy. Alright, here's a little bit of something about me, okay? I love music. In the 8th grade, we can, uh... In the 8th grade, we can do marching band. Some schools don't do that, but... Well, I'm done cutting it. I'll be back to y'all when I have half of the head done. No. Yes. No. I'm going to do one so I can show some of y'all people who aren't black and who don't get braids. Take them out. So you start here and then you unravel it. Sometimes it gets tangled. So you probably have to either cut it or not even cut it. You probably just got to deal with it, man. And... I'm going to just show you one braid. Oh, wow. This one is <laughs> And I'm very tender-headed, okay? Like, I can take my own pay when I'm doing my hair, but when someone else does it, bro, I tell you, I scream. I scream, yo. Like, I scream. I legit scream. Like, I can't. Sometimes I cry. They're probably like, you a baby for doing that. Sure. Thanks. Appreciate it. I actually love babies. They're adorable. Oh, thank you for calling me adorable. Oh my gosh, that was so weird. But just look at that. It's all curly. My hair is probably gonna look just like this. Oh, found my hair. There it is. Like I'm really trying to go back natural. All right, that's one braid. I have a total of eight braids in my hair. My hair is much longer than you see it, okay? I promise you. Do I need to wash it now? Ooh, the, the curl is kind of cute though. All right, let me get back to you guys when I have this whole half of my head. background that's my fan in my face okay so this is what this side looks like i really I actually kind of like it like this i really like it like this i really do i should probably try putting curls in it i'm probably gonna make a video about that too <laughs> But I have like all this stuff in my hair at the front. Like I love it. Okay, I'm gonna turn the wind speed down. All right, the noise it made, bro. All right. 
So I'm just, right now I'm just separating the parts that still have like gel on it. That's the parts that was probably messing it up. All right, time for the other side. Now this side right here, I'm gonna still talk to y'all. This side right here, it's probably gonna be my worst. Y'all probably like, don't speak that, honey. Where is it? That's gonna be something to go through. I'm gonna get back to y'all when I get on that one. Well, I'm gonna first do this one, then, you know. I, oh, I was talking about my uh, science teacher, right? Yeah, he was a science teacher. I think I mentioned that, I'm not sure I forget it. But um, he was a terrible teacher. He would yell at me, me. He yelled at me, like of all people, me. Why me, why not everybody else? Because I was speaking the facts. I said, he doesn't even teach. And he was like, Joy. I'm like, it's not that serious that you need to scream my name. I'm just, you can't handle the truth. That's the issue with him. All right, guys, I'm going to get back to you when I get on. When I get back, when I get to this one. I decided to go ahead and do the one in the way back and I'm gonna go ahead and do this one this one's about to be I heard some in the background my bad okay so I got so I get so distracted uh, back to the science teacher well I'm gonna tell you about my other teachers well he was my sixth period so here's how it would go. It would it would be our first two. It would first be homeroom, which would be your third period teacher. And then right after homeroom, you would go to your two encores. And after you would go to your two encores, you would go back to your homeroom class, which is your third period. And then after that, I'll go to fourth period, fifth, sixth, and seventh, and leave. That my best class was leaving. Just kidding. My best class was banned. So, homeroom. I had this teacher named Miss Tambu. We're not gonna get into that. Um, she is the reason why I don't like eighth grade. <laughs> oh my gosh, I thought she was gonna be a great teacher. When I was in seventh grade, I wanted her. <sighs> I prayed for that teacher. She is not the one for me. Uh oh, we're getting into that area. Oh no. She's just the teacher that you don't want. You seventh grade teachers, I mean, you seventh grade students, um who who were in seventh grade during the school year be wise about who you want oh my gosh <laughs> as i said this would be terrible it's like there's something in my hair it's a knot it's okay we're almost there we almost there Okay, so yeah, so girls, be wise about who you want. Miss Chamber's not the one. She is not the one for you. She's not the one she need. You need. Be smart about who you want. Okay, okay, okay. Be smart about who you want. Be smart about who you need. Okay, Miss Tambu is not the one. Oh, my head feels so much lighter. Like from all of the girls who, who begin raising. When you take out the braids and then you have it out, it feels like someone's pushing your head forward. I know I'm not the only one who feels that because I know I'm not the only one who feels that. If I'm the only one who feels that, oh, we might have an issue here. Okay. So I'm going to separate my hair so I can, I want to comb it out, but it's so cute like this. Okay. Alright. Yeah. But yeah, so it'll first be Miss Tambu. I'm gonna I'm gonna talk to y'all while I'm just sitting here. So why not? Okay, so I have this teacher named Miss Tambu. She gave me literal 
okay? She made me not like eighth grade. She made me not want to go back. The first day, I was cool. Second day, I was cool. That first, that first week or two of school, I was cool. Okay, I was cool. But then she had the she started getting an attitude with me and all the other people in there. She said, You need to come in and say good morning. I'm like, I'm I'm fresh. I'm fresh. Calm down. It's not that serious. Ooh, I'm I'm starting to shake my hair a lot because of the Sorry, I'm doing the most. Uh Okay. And then right after Miss Chambu, I'll go to Mr. Burns. I I think that was my favorite core teacher, like a main teacher, uh, that I had. Because we're allowed to eat in this class. If I'm allowed to eat in your class, that's an automatic yes. That's an automatic yes. No one's changing my mind. He's my fourth period teacher. He was also my lunch period. And I'll leave it. He's, but here's the worst thing about having him. If we have a substitute and we act up, um, we all get after school detention. That that whole class period, we, because of one person, we all get detention. But I feel like we were gonna get it at some point. We never did because we got coins. Ew. Okay. I forgot what I was doing. Oh, yeah. So he, and then when it was like, I think. It was about to be like winter break he um he he gave us this packet that we have to do well i mean i did it i turned it in i got a grade oh i did i just skip right to fourth period i forgot about my own course so for for physical education pe gym i like to call it gym i'm gonna call it gym so for gym i i had we at my school we have um one two we have we have four uh PE teachers and you and it depends which class you're in, okay? So I have this teacher named Mr. Lyon. He is cool. He, he I did whatever I wanted to. If I wanted to be on the phone, I was on my phone and he did not care. And like he saw me with my phone. He was like, get off your phones. And then like he would come back. He only he only did that to like let these teachers know that he got it in the bag. And then he walked back up to us and then he said, Y'all can be on your phones, I don't really care. He was like <laughs> so yeah and then after pe i'll go to band well in band i'm in percussion and listen band was the only reason why i had the energy to get up in the morning that no to get up to go to school in the morning if it wasn't for mr Ma okay his name is mr Matta lavage but back in sixth grade, we called him Mr. Magalavage Savage. Because back then, savage was really a word back then. Like, people used it a lot. I'm like, I'm savage. Savage, bro? Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then, like, I, my favorite instrument in, in band was the timpani this this beautiful instrument i said bang i started playing it in seventh grade because when i was in sixth grade all i did was play snare the whole time but in sixth grade he had it he had the uh they had the xylophone instruments and marimbas and stuff on the left side and then he had like the snare drum bass drum timpani and all the other stuff on the right side but he changed it so now the uh so now it's like switched to a different side i was like oh that's kind of cool when i came in second in seventh grade it was i was like oh my gosh y'all probably don't even want to hear my conversation right now so i'm all right i'm gonna head out y'all all right thank you guys for watching i will keep talking more about this on another day about school i'll talk about it another day but don't forget to like comment and subscribe oh and about comments don't for all right go down below and comment what videos you want me to do 
next. All right, have a blessed day now. Peace.